John. Hello. Hey, Jake. Hello. Hi, Hans. Hey. My first success of this task is opening that door on the first try. Another day. Another task for the taskmaster. That's me. Hit a ball with a ball. Most impressive shot wins. You have 15 minutes to complete your shot. When you have finished your shot, say, that's how it's done. Your time starts now. It starts now. So I just have to hit a ball with a ball. Uh, hit a ball with a ball. All right, so this was very open to interpretation. A number of different types of balls were provided, and they had to decide what was the most impressive way that they could hit one of the balls with another ball. So we're going to start off with the ladies plus John, EJ, Tracy, and John. Let's see what they came up with and how they did. Your time starts now. Okay, um, time starts now, so I just have to hit a ball with a ball. Most impressive shot wins. Hit a ball with a ball. <laughs> this thing scares me a little bit. Um, <clears throat> like hit the mug, break the mug, and then ball falls. <laughs> well, I'm not going to win by doing like Yeah, I want a window open. I want to attempt this. I was tempted to tuck it in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is my first attempt. And I got contact all the way out here. Hey, that's how it's done. <laughs> yep. We have 30 seconds to spare. All right, so three different attempts there. I'm going to see if the taskmaster has any questions or thoughts about those. Amazing ingenuity, stunning athletics, sparkling commentary. It's electrifying. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to move on then to Devin for our rather unique approach. We're going to see him all by himself. Okay. But if I can get this and hit it off of two balls, double points. Need a little bit more power here. Too much power. Wow. Maybe if I switch it up, maybe a different ball. Maybe if I can just get it from a higher angle. Ugh. I've watched a lot of Dude Perfect, and therefore <laughs> uh, I feel completely qualified to be doing this. Gotta aim it, and Ooh. this is annoying. Not even working. Pivot, and this will be impressive. I'm a bit of a genius. I forgot about it has to hit a ball with Alright, uh, we're workshopping. Another plank. 
maybe a little closer. Ball here, ball. There's three different goals. Test 25. A ball, a ball. Oh, they both went in one. You can do better. Hit a ball with a ball. Hit a ball with a ball. All right. Oh, I'm just overflowing with ideas now. So I need something to stabilize. This is how we got to to make cars in the internet. Oh, okay. We really want to get that nice YouTube shot, so we gotta make sure that this doesn't fall over. Contingency plan. There we go, hit ball. New idea. If it rolls off here, hits this ball, falls into this one. All right. <laughs> now that time is done. Devin, I have a question. At what point during that task did you forget what the task was? Um, next question. I, see, for me, it was the point at which you said something about Dude Perfect and then started trying to do um, some of those type of shots and it became about getting the YouTube shot and inventing, what was it, the internet and cars? Well, uh, through trial and error, mankind has overcome every hurdle that nature has sent against us. Uh, and I tried to recreate that with my ever-expanding process here. A couple of st statistics. Um, the, the final attempt that he used as his official shot was his 44th attempt at <laughs> hitting a ball with a ball. Um, he said the phrase, hit a ball with a ball, 16 times during the 15 minutes it took to complete that. We have saved Hans for the end, uh, all by himself, which generally means something either very good or very bad. Uh, so we will find out now um, which it is. Your time starts now. Anywhere? Let's see. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Let's use Alright, this is just a test shot. It's less cinematic. Time. Uh, uh, that's not how it's done. Oy vey. The elevation, the up and down, I haven't for the past month. I've just been sitting in my office writing and I don't walk very much every day. This has been very healthy for me, but demoralizing all the same. <laughs> all right. Well, good effort. On to the next thing. Is there any uh, processing you would like to do, Hans? 
Um, not really. I think big swings are worth taking, even if they don't come off, you know? I, um, I was dedicated to the task. I feel good. I mean, I don't, I don't feel points good, but I feel good, you know? I tried something. Yeah, so obviously what was attempted, um, you know, was mission failed. Um, if you're looking for something to consider as a completion of the task, uh, we did have this one moment here. No. <laughs> so there, there was arguably contact of a ball with a ball there, um, but uh, yeah, turn it over to the taskmaster. Well, that may have just saved you, and you did say that's not how it's done at the end, which contains all the same words as that's how it's done. So I think that may have saved you from being disqualified, and I'm going to give you one point for the oh. effort. Devin, I'm sorry, I'm afraid it's two points for you. Um, while the overall experience was amazing, and how I'm defining it is just when the balls make contact with each other. So that in and of itself, I feel not terribly impressive. So two points for Devin. Um, now, between all the other um, exciting attempts, I feel Tracy, yours was fairly, uh, as the British Taskmaster contestants are often saying, route one. Uh, you went to a window, you dropped a ball, you dropped the ball on top of another ball. Um, you did it, three points. Um, and then, EJ, it was very exciting to watch, but as the ultimate shot was not upside down, I think I'm going to give the five points to John and the four to EJ.